even after the Prime Minister's entourage wheeled out of St. Clair, those who had gathered in support of Dr. Kublal Singh and stayed on to see the Prime Minister's visit milled around. The visit and word that the PM had elected not to engage in mediation at this time appeared to disappoint some, including former government minister Lincoln Myers. This cannot be simply a, a photo op for the Prime Minister. There is too much at stake here. And Kubla Singh, as far as I am concerned, is a man of the highest integrity. We want mediation, we want mediation now. A man's life is at stake and, and this has just gone way, way too far. Ray Hallman saw the vigil, the PM's visit, and the way the crowd reacted to it, all as positive signs. I think we'll have mediation. I'm pretty confident. And this will make the country grow up to her husband. Vocalist Mohammed Muakil, a member of Freetown Collective, says dialogue is a vital part of democracy. Instead of coming on and talking to people, we're going to disregard things. And I think from what you see here tonight, everybody basically is fed up with that. You know what I mean? We are not stupid people. We're not unintelligent people. And if there is something that you want to do with our money and our place, then talk to us about it. But he says he's encouraged by the events of the day. A healthy democracy does not reach to the state before democracy is exercised. And that's the truth. So the fact that we are here, maybe it means that democracy is healing. Maybe we are the white blood cells. CNews understands that proposed talks between Minister Suraj Rambachan and the civil society groups that wrote to the Prime Minister requesting mediation have fallen flat. Jonathan Chase, CNews.